churches across the L.A. Archdiocese paid tribute to Bishop Daniel O'Connell at Sunday Masses today. Meanwhile, we're still waiting to learn who shot him and why. Eyewitness News reporter Leanne Suter live in Hacienda Heights, where a memorial is growing outside the crime scene. Leanne? So much shock and sadness for the Catholic community, especially now that they have learned that Bishop David O'Connell's death is now being treated as a homicide. They are now saying he was murdered just a short time ago. Several of his fellow priests turning out here with parishioners and friends and neighbors here for a prayer service. Just take a listen. For the You can see the crowd gathering this afternoon here to honor the 69 year old gathering right here at the crime scene, right in front of the crime scene tape. This as investigators continue their search for answers. Detectives now calling the case a homicide. Bishop O'Connell found shot to death inside a home in Hacienda Heights yesterday afternoon. Investigators have not released any information about a possible suspect or a motive for the murder. Those who knew the bishop say they are stunned by the deadly violence and say they have no idea who would want to hurt him. You talk to him for one minute and he's your best friend. And he was everywhere in the San Gabriel Valley at all of our different events. And so um, just wonderful man. He had a wonderful sense of humor and a beautiful devotion to Mary, our blessed mother. We all will miss him very much. Archbishop Jose Gomez expressing his shock and sadness this morning during mass after learning O'Connell's death is now being investigated as a murder. The 69 year old is described as a peacemaker with a passion for serving those in need, especially in the immigrant community. A native of Ireland, he had been a priest with the LA Archdiocese for 45 years. He was well known and well loved throughout the Catholic community. Back live now again, no word on any potential suspect and no word on any possible motive. Detectives only saying last night that there is no current threat to the community. Live in Hacienda Heights, Lee Hyun Suter, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC 7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC 7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.